What's up guys? Welcome back to Goose Nuggets. I'm Jenny and that's... Today we are having chicken soup. Fish maw chicken soup to be exact. What is fish maw you may ask? It's actually a fish bladder that controls your buoyancy so it's high in collagen. It's a Chinese delicacy. It's actually enjoyed by nobles back in, in ancient times. So there's like a huge boom of spicy Chinese hot pots. Yeah, she likes those. So there's like so many. There's like Hai Di Lao Xiao Long Tan. But this is like a non spicy version. So it's great and refreshing. You can actually drink the soup, etc. Healthy, healthy, healthy option. Healthy yes. Option. This is what is it? Once the soup boils, they rip up the chicken with just a little fork and it just falls off the bone. That's how much the chicken has been stewed for a long time. It's so soft. So first they give you soup. You enjoy the soup first before you do anything else. After the soup, it's time to have the chicken. The chicken is super tender, falls off the bone. There's meat in the soup. You can actually taste the meat, like the flavors of the meat along with the soup. Because you know they like stew this chicken in this soup for like a long time. The chicken sauce is like so concentrated. Yeah. The soup is amazing. Holy crap. There is so much collagen in this soup. Your lips are like sticky after you drink the soup. So much collagen. After the soup is cooled down a little bit, there's like a film of collagen on your soup. That's crazy. <laughs> Fishy tofu, okay. And the fish balls? You guys should eat those first. So you don't 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 <laughs> Pro tip, you should eat all the fish balls and all the vegetables first. And then the meat later. Because the meat will kind of mess up the soup a little bit because of the Yeah. So that meat should be last. So this is the actual fish mall. It's like a little clear, little jiggly. Kind of chewy, like a tendon. Mm. And it's kind of gooey. Gooey and chewy at the same time. I think there's a Chinese saying if you eat more of that, it has smoother skin and whiter skin. Yes, because it's full of collagen. Like people, there's so many people eating collagen powders nowadays. Dude, the ancient Chinese people, they knew how to do it, man. Jiahua, shrimp paste balls. I think this one is pretty good as well. Because you can actually taste the uh, shrimp bit. It's super fresh and it's good. <laughs> what is this, Terry? Sun Mei Tan. Sun Mei Tan is like plum juice. Plum juice. Plum juice, but in a bottle, I've never seen this. What kind of beef is this? It's Yeah, the marbling is really good though. They're so thin, it just cooks right away. It's like paper thin. Beef is really good too. Yeah. yeah. When you ask for more soup, they actually give you the original soup base. They don't just give you water. That's pretty good. Does this taste like anything in Korea? Yes, this is what Korea is. It's a similar thing in Korea. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, the ginseng chicken. Oh, it's like healthier soup. Yes, yes. You guys like that too in Korea, right? We eat when we are sick. So there's so many hot pot places in Richmond right now that like popping up. Like the more popular ones these days are the spicy ones. But I think this one's a bit special, very different because you can actually drink the soup. The soup is their main attraction here. But other than the soup, the other ingredients are really fresh too. So I think this is a very nice break from all the spicy ones. And it's right on number three. It's super convenient to get here. There's a Sky Train station either side. 
So after tips, it came to be six fifty ish Canadian dollars. It fit the nine of us, but we were so full, we had to pack up a lot of food to go. It might seem kind of pricey for Chinese food, but on average, that's kind of the amount you would spend for a Chinese hot pot nowadays. Especially in higher end ones, like, mm. like, like, like. like these ones, because higher end, they give you like fresh ingredients. You can drink the soup. If it's like bad ingredients, you'll taste it right away. Not like some of the spicy ones, they might get away with some of the not so fresh ingredients. But these ones, they can't get away with it. I like it. I'll give it a thumbs up. Me too. Come try it next time, guys. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and share. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe. Happy eating. Bye. Today, today's, today's video is sponsored by this guy. And that guy. And that guy. Yeah. Yeah. Kevin. 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 Kevin's buying everything. So, uh, sponsor. Thank you. Oh, it's 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 it's